I like this game. This is gonna be a really good game. Oh. We were enchanted by the idea of freedom. She is not happy. He doesn't like him. We could not resist it. Whole families took to the streets. France was never so happy. <laughs> That's the Aristos. We were enchanted yeah. by the idea of freedom. Also, I don't like uh, kids viewing like disaster like that. Why? I. I mean. Oh. oh act one. Liberté. Day one. I don't know. I mean, yes, it's reality of the time, but I. It's just. Gruesome. <gasps> oh no. Find out which verdict is expected by the factions and your clo and your clo find out which verdict is expected by the factions and your close ones. Okay. So um, they want us to expect oh, sentence prison. So alright, hold on, no no no. I had a scroll about the below. So Here? No 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 below uh, prison. So everyone wants to prison this guy. The revolutionaries in the comic book want to start Oh, I see, I see. Alright, so what's the story behind this? Let's see. John Renard, a 45 year old innkeeper, has been charged with fraud. He's accused of diluting alcohol in his tavern, tricking his clients into paying extra. Guests came in with their minds set on a specific goal, getting roaring drunk. But instead of staggering out after two, drinking two pitchers of wine and several pints of beer, they would sit in at the inn till morning, still sober and completely penniless. The innkeeper shroud came to light when one of the customers discovered the scam and caught the cheetah in the act. That man entered the host's cellar and witnessed him diluting the alcohol in the barrels with ordinary water. As a result, customers received only par four parts of what they paid for and one part from the water carriers. Oh. Okay. Cool. So he was getting money out of them by diluting the water. Yeah. Okay, cool. So the, stor so the story probably is the diluting alcohol and then getting roaring drunk. And then the crime is, um, is dilution of the alcohol. Or, yes. Okay, cool. All right. Yeah, let's, let's unlock questions. Oh, protocol. Oh, okay. Review the trial's records. <laughs> okay. They have no records. So, no, no, not verdict. Not yet. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> You're guilty! <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Take him away! <laughs> Drew has not reached verdict. All right, let's see. We have to go ahead and question him. News? They need to view this. This is too much sometimes. Oh. The father had a rare episode of foolishness when he decided to stand up to some strong stranger, threatening him in at with a fist and throwing, showing his throat there safe on the side. He did not listen to your argument. Furthermore, he gave a precise description of where you could shove him. We have to kill him. Hire thugs. The father had a rare episode of foolishness when he decided to stand up to some known stronger, threatening him with a fist and showing his children mm. that they are safe by his side. Um, Was that against you? I don't know. What are the effects? Oh. I'm gonna ignore. Okay. Alright. Let's go get All some right. let's go with some questions. Okay. So oh the m methods. <coughs> oh, 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 sorry, sorry. So the motive So the wit right, so the witnesses are the Customer's drunkenness, is that a witness? That's not, that sounds that sounds weird. Method, uh, adding water, right? Yes. And then diluting alcohol is that a method as well? Or is that motive? His motive would be to dilute the alcohol, right? Yes. Yes. No. So go back to the story. Go back to the story. <laughs> Alright. So the witness. So we're looking for witnesses. So guests came with their minds setting speed, getting roaring drunk. Discovered the scam. And caught the cheater in the uh, side. So witness is the one who discovered the scam. Yeah. But that's not 
There are no witnesses right now. Oh, witnesses would be exposing. Yes? Possibly? <sighs> this one doesn't make complete... I don't... Uh, Alright. Oh, we can move this. That's cool. Oh. Oh, good. Yeah, keep that on screen, maybe. Right here? Yeah. Can we do that? Is that another, th is that another thing? Is that a thing? I'm not sure. Because it's... Okay, so it doesn't make complete sense in what they're asking them. Because, like... So... I just want to... It's... Alright. Innkeeper's fraud came to light when one of the customers discovered the scam. Okay, yes, yes, so, yeah, so that, that is one of the witnesses is, is exposing the innkeeper is one of the witnesses? Yes, okay, cool. And then the motives, all right, the method. We already discovered the method, right? So we have two more questions to reveal. So the witnesses, we, have, we don't have a motive right now. No. Is customer's drunkenness, is that one of the witnesses, or is that one of the, No. Yeah, that's their state of being. <laughs> so that, that's probably not one of the things, then, yeah. Um, I mean, the innkeeper kind of witnessed it, sort of, or the method. Is it, Would diluting alcohol be the method? Or, is, or do we try that already? I think we tried that already. Okay, don't try it again, then. Oh, wait. What? Why are these oh, two? Oh, that has to be, then? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Let me click on it and see if, and see if. Okay, no. Okay, so, so, so can I be the method or the oh, motive? Oh, okay. And he's none of these. Okay. Okay. So is the customer's drunkenness that a motive? Well, his motive is money, not so much the customer's drunkenness. I think it's the exploit so that they want to get drink more, in order to feel drunk. I suppose. It's because the file is that, um. Cause yes, came with their mindset on getting roaring drunk. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you want to do that then? Yeah. I'm, okay. I hope I'm not wrong. I hope my logic is. Yeah. So be his motive. Yeah. Yes. Oh, there we brilliant. Go. Okay, cool. Let's question them. Let's question this bad mother trucker. Uh, yep, we're good. You had to click on a member to question him. Yeah. Oh. In difficult times, do people like to see play pieces at the bottom of the glass? Please introduce yourself. <clears throat> My name is John Renard, Monsieur Le Judge. Nothing but a fraud. Systematically opposing the opinion of a jury may lead to serious consequence. At all. I mean, this dude's pretty guilty. Uh. Wait, what, what was that? What was the things on the side? Excuse me. I think we want to see this guy hang. Let's let's, let's just influence the, the the jury to let this guy hang. Uh, so so yeah. So just click on well, that. Who's Thomas though? Is that the probably person? one of his friends? It doesn't mention Thomas in the story. Yeah. Yeah. So go back to the questions, probably. Yeah, we're still ignoring that. Notebook. Neighboring God. This is from the other thing. Yeah. And he's not available. No. Yeah. Yeah. So it's, it's probably just it's probably just a witness <coughs> mm -hmm. um, on the guy's side. Okay. Back to questions. How long you've been involved in the illegal practice of diluting alcohol? Well, because we don't want to get this guy a fair trial. We this guy's obviously guilty. We just need we just need to convince the jury that he's guilty. Uh, okay. So we don't want to click on that one because that one will con will convince the jury that he's not guilty. Oh. But this guy is definitely guilty. How long have you been involved in the legal practice of diluting alcohol? It's not a legal practice. Everyone has a beat. I mean, yeah, but this guy has like three fourths. In your case, it was a bit of wine in the water and not the other way around. How have you been doing this? For have you been doing this for a long time? A few weeks at the most. It's been hard to earn a living lately. I used to run an enormous business. Pure wine was over spilling the glasses. A likely story. Is there any proof to support your testimony? He, oh, he lied to the... Oh, sorry, that's the crowd. Go yeah. for it. He lied to his customers. No reason he wouldn't lie in court. That's right. Kill his Shouldn't mother trucker. Should the jury like, be quiet about this? No. It's the French Revolution. Yep. Let's convince him. Come on. Let's keep going. Convince this, convince this guy should hang. 
How do you feel about trickery? Wary citizens. Like, I don't want to every... kill anyone. I know. I know. The French Revolution. Yeah. Just because it's the French Revolution doesn't mean you have a license to kill. Yeah, but there's only two options. I know. And I'm going to see what I can do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's try this. Do your clients drink a lot? Davin drink leaders usually drink a lot. So, you have been selling plenty of wine. Quite a lot, yes. And yet you have been paying taxes, and yet you have been paying taxes on the amount of wine you have bought, <gasps> not the amount of wine you've been selling, correct? Oh, I don't understand. This guy's guilty. Yes. You have been paying taxes on four wine barrels, by, but by adding... A quarter of water to each, you have actually made money for selling five barrels of wine. That's one way of putting it. Perhaps it is correct. I'm not too good with numbers. Yep. Well, you know what? You won't be good at. You're not good with numbers <laughs> yet. You're good enough to have calculated the fraud pays. That Off of his head. Pays. I was nowhere. It will take time. I will take that into that answer into account. Yes. Off of his head. Um. Do I just go with a verdict now? What? Oh, uh, we'll just do the one last question. I think. Hold on. He think he they sh he should be acquitted. Yeah. But that's not the response I'm getting. The way I'm interpreting the response doesn't sound like. Uh, yeah, but everyone else wants you to hang him. Why you get to kill him? How do you feel about treating your sentences? Terrible. But all they wanted to do was to keep my business afloat. Others don't mess around for sure. No, that looting would be the end of me. This guy's pretty shady. She decided to commit fraud as to not lose money. If I lost my tavern, my family would starve to death. Do you have children? I do. One son and two daughters. Time to starve, saving up for the dowry. Mm. Oh. Um, because child labor. They didn't say he didn't say there was, they were children. They could if if he's saving up for a dowry, then you know then they're almost about eight marrying age. Oh. So, and 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 when we don't know how old they are. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's, no, no, it's not. It's not. It's just imprisoning him. It's not killing him. Yeah, I mean, you you were saying off their head. I don't want to. Oh, sorry. No, I don't think that's an option. Never mind. Yeah, everyone. Yeah, everyone wants to. Everyone wants to, because both because both both the revolutionaries and the common people want him to go. Yeah. Imprison him. Yeah. Just another day's work. I sentence Citizen Jean Renard to prison. Lead the condemned out. Huzzah. Long live pure wine. Okay. Nice. Moving on. After the trial, click to news in the next part. Cool. I have a feeling there's to be more than one trial in the day. They might be. May I remind you that you promised to join me? I have a feeling that tonight's moon favors gamblers. I don't want to gamble. Though it does not favor spouses, please don't. God should grace us with wives who understand the importance of an eating game of dice. So also know that the random out of line guarantees a lucky roll. That's not very revolutionary. I should go home. Bringing a judge to the game has benefits. Other players will surely not cheat. This is not a strong argument. My name is Jacques, uh, Jacques Lee David. David. I am but a humble painter, not a silver tongued judge. But, yeah. You're a sly politician, Jacques. Is it Jacques? Yeah. Yeah. As a politician, I understand the importance of keeping promises. And you, my friend, are trying to get out of yours. I'm going home. Yeah. I'm like, not tonight, Jack. Good job. We're turning our life around for the revolution. Down with the Aristos. Like, if my kid's getting into a fight because I'm a bad influence, <laughs> I'm not. I'm going to change my ways. Look at that. We're being a good family man, John.
What? Do, do, do it. Do you not want to berate me like you always do? I'm glad you're home. Are you aware that Friedrich sometimes imagines you as a deep sea sailor? He dreams that you visit distant countries and have wonderful adventures. What do you mean deep sea sailor? Surely, uh, like, off for a long time. And surely, but never, surely like, a well, sailor that's deep sea like is a Ahab. bad sailor. Captain Ahab from um, yeah, Moby but, Dick. Yeah, but surely he's not a deep sea sailor. Like, surely a deep sea sailor is one who is under the sea, and that means that he's a bad sailor. <laughs> anyway. Fine, it's a funny joke. But he would rather have you by his side, on land. We all want that. I don't want to watch the storm blow your lifeboat away and bury it beneath the waves. There are no waves. They are colorism. The storm is getting closer. Dark clouds already hang over the shores. I just just wait until they finish building the Kia team. Your oars will break at once and the waves will take you to a place you'll wish you soon never set foot on. Thank you, uh Thank you, Dark lovely Omen. <laughs> There's another word for it, but I can't remember at the moment. Sea witch. No, no. another word for omen. A place we sat us. At least we're home, though. Your family loves you, but we won't find you in the darkness that has already begun to reach for you. But we stayed home and didn't go drinking with the boys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, family actions. Upon returning home, you can decide how you'd like to spend the rest of the day. <clears throat> Various actions. Each action will affect another member of the family as well as his attitude towards you. <clears throat> Director's attitudes. Each character's attitude can provide you, can provide, provide with you or deprive you. Of certain bonuses, reputation, reputation factions. Your youngest son is special. His attitude may take to other family members like you slightly more. Take good care of him. Makes the other family members t like you slightly more. Okay. I kind of want to so spend time doing? with Bernard to mend whatever relationship with with him. Or we could just kill him. He doesn't. It seems like he's far behind beyond. So not gambling though. Yeah. Not gambling. So, did I just click? Choose an action left panel on the side. You have to choose an action to see its description. No, no yeah. the action. Yeah, yeah I get it. I was just seeing if clicking on them did anything. Um, so, does clicking on it make it so you, so you immediately pick them? or? Okay, no, it doesn't. Okay. Uh, I see. So, those will go down. I kind of prefer that, actually. Evening stroll? Well, what I'm is open theater, night of the theater? Okay. So what about no. evening stroll, eh? Yeah, evening stroll. Okay. And then click on the right, bottom right. Oh, right there. I didn't even see that. Oh, jeez. Oh, but these are revolutionary. <clears throat> and so now our revolutionaries are going, to, are going to be less. So... And then we might get killed. So next action, we should please the revolutionaries then. Eh... Well, because the revolutionaries decide if we live or die. I'd rather be a family, go out as a family man. 